for. <laughs> We've been going for four hours. Essendon Football Club. 25 minutes. How far? <laughs> it's Aaron Phillips, Sean Burgoyne, and Anton Mitchell. <laughs> That's the furthest one by a mile. Seven hours in the car, cooks it, and this is what dreams are made of. Oh. It's not even in Essendon. <laughs> Such sorts. We are on our way to the Saints' home ground. I think it is Moorabbin. We're on our way. It's called R-E-A-C Park or something. R-E-S Park or something. So we're on our way to St Kilda. It's our first stop. And then after we go see the Saints, we're going to Hawthorne. Going to every footy club driving challenge. We're going to every footy club driving challenge. Google Maps says we're near the St Kilda Football Club. But if I'm going to be honest, I feel like we're just in a neighbourhood. Like this does not feel like a football club. Oh, there it is. In the, oh, oh, in the Saints. Come marching in. Yeah, good. You want the irrelevant guy on, Ken? Oh, jeez. It's been a while since you've been on the tube. I'm just looking for the G train, baby. Something's on. Something's on here. I'm she and she a hand. And these kids, one of these kids will be for the next Nathaniel Fife, you know? And it's f***ing grouse. <laughs> the Dragons Intra Club. They all watch ya. <laughs> Some of these kids are playing and they're watching this video right now. That's probably not the best To choose, really. No, really. That's footy, though. That's fighting talk. <laughs> That's footy talk. <laughs> Alright, officially, if we touch the logo, we tick the Saints off. Go on. Yeah! Oh, <laughs> 25 minutes, Waverley Park. Is that near Glen Waverley? I think so. Yeah, right. Head east on Doongar Avenue, then turn left onto Clay Street. I'm gonna admit it, I'll admit it, I'll admit it. We're like three minutes away, but we are in the sticks. Yeah, there's, I no, don't, there's no footy over around here, I tell I you. I don't know where we are. Like, compared to the Saints ground, which was quite suburban, this feels like we're in the sticks. Oh, that's sick. That's pretty fing big, isn't it? The Rikon Centre. Are we at the G? The home of VFL football. Is it? Oh, that's sick. I'm touching the logo to tick off the Hawthorne. Here we are at the Rikon Centre. Oh, come on. Oh, I did it, I did it. <laughs> it's Aaron Phillips, Sean Burgo and Anton Mitchell. Brownlow medalists and a couple of footy players. I like these facilities. There is a massive grandstand. So this used to be Waverley Park. It used to be like a full stadium all the way around. This place has hosted a grand final. What grand final? What year? 1993 is what I'm going to guess. Not a chance. 1980 something? At the 93 would have been the G Center, I would have thought. No, nah, there was one year that the G couldn't have it because oh, of really? COVID. Because of COVID. Oh, shit. Dude, but we've got to get going because it's nearly 12 o'clock. All right. It's been gone for what? How long already? Two and a bit hours. It's about nine, yeah, so about two and a half. So now we're out of the burbs for a second. We're going to the CBD. We're going to Richmond, Collingwood, and the D's, which are in the same, like, Kilometre radius Definitely of each other. Touch three different logos. Yep. Going to every footy club driving challenge. We're going to every footy club driving challenge. Bit of a trek from from Hawthorne, but we're going to have a sus of what Punt Road has to offer. Yeah. Can you get a photo of me in front of this? Oh, it's Katie Brennan. Oh, it's Katie Brennan. Thoughts on the Tigers? Uh, didn't let us in, so I like Hawthorne more than Richmond now. All right, we've been to some amazing complexes. But this is the Melbourne Footy Club. Don't shit on. Oh, is this it? <laughs> this is it. <laughs> really? Yeah. All right. All right. So, we touched the logo. I think the premierships and stuff are in there potentially, but. Um, Where are they? I haven't seen them for six years. <laughs> but, but that's it. It's at Amy Park, it's at a soccer stadium, and that's where the Melbourne Footy Club usually train. I think we've been training at a Casey Fields recently, but. This it is, is it. The more you know, hey? Let's go to the Pies. Now down the road from the D's, and we're at the Pies. Do you want me to give Brody Grundy a kiss? Give him a kiss. Gummy, you big sexy. Give him a kiss, give him a kiss. We've touched the logo. Smack! Yes. Used to be the Lexus Centre back in the day. It used to be the peak of all AFL facilities. We've nailed one at the Hawks and now we're at the Pies. Very you get one shot at this. Oh no. Going to every footy club driving challenge. We're going to every footy club driving challenge. We're about halfway. We've been going for three and a half hours. We've been going for four hours. We'll see how we feel after Carlton. We're about to knock off North, Bulldogs, then to Essendon, and then we got the long trip down to Cadinia Park. Oh, that's that's home. That's yeah, home true. time, baby. That's the, that's the beauty. There's a bloody AFLW game on. We can't that's, get a park. That's a, that's a girl. I'm going to try something. What's he trying? What am I trying? trying? What am I doing? He said he's 12. Jesus, what the f***? <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> Lost his head a bit there. Sure oh. I've done me hip. <laughs> You're sore. I've done me hip. I played footy with him. I played footy with him. He was better than me. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we need to touch it. Need to touch it. Oh, 
COVID. Chicken wing it. I'm COVIDing it. <laughs> yes. Let's get exclusive footage of the <laughs> AFLW game. Dockers are here. This is unsanctioned filming. <laughs> unsanctioned filming of an elite sporting event. Are Fox Footy going to sue me? And look, all these people, you're a caught on camera now, bro. <laughs> so years ago, as a member, the club was struggling and they asked for a donation yeah. and you get, you get a, a tile. Bricky, you get a brick. So your Tally, Wiley. family's brick well, you got one. Where is, it? is somewhere here. This is just to prove I'm indebted forever into their cook. No, I swear oh, it's probably going to be down that end, isn't it? See, that's that's my name. And that's me last name. That's me dad. That's me mum. That's me brother. <laughs> Shit! Red, white, and blue. How we do? Liver. Oh, what about liver's height? No, he's taller than me. You are taller than her. Timmy English has Dutchie covered. Does he? Yeah, by about two or three centimetres. Embarrassing being against. We're on to the second last leg. We're off to Essendon. Is on. it in Avalon? I mean, no, Tullamarine. Yeah. That's got to be further than Hawthorne. It's not even in Essendon. Let's just go to Windy Hill and call it a day. Essendon Football Club, Tullamarine. 25 minutes. <laughs> That's the furthest one by a mile. Face. <laughs> what you want this? <laughs> He's disgruntled. How far? <laughs> He's disgruntled. How far? 25 minutes. <laughs> um, yeah, that's north. North of the border type style. <laughs> Alright, we knock over the bummers and then we're on the home stretch. Let's go, boys. If, if this doesn't qualify us as thespians, I don't know what does. <laughs> oh, 20. 25. A tight 25, you reckon? <laughs> tight 25. I've got a loose 15 hanging, but I don't know about a tight 25. We're going to every footy club driving challenge. We're going to every footy club driving challenge. Such sorts. Like, we milk it, don't we? Like, they're five and five, everyone's like, they're sucking, so cool. oh, it's so hard. <laughs> well, we have all these challenges, and then when push comes to shove, it's actually really annoying getting them done. Well, we love but, it. Wait, I, I don't want to say that the five and five was annoying. That was actually, like, looking back, it's probably one of the funnest things I've done. Probably the best moment but, of my life. But, but it was tiring. Oh, it was... Like, you can't help your body's fatigue. The facilities are sick, I think. But it sucks. I just can't believe the pastures that they train at. It's just shrubberies. They're winning the spoon, aren't they? I did tip that. I take that back, though. I feel bad. Well, you we have to pick a team, so who are you going to take for them? Say probably the Adelaide. As if you wouldn't just say the Roos. Nah. We're probably going to be bad, and we have no fans to bully us. It looks like a mental institute. Like, it looks like a... There you reckon? Gate shut. Is that the only way in? Gate is shut on this exclusive establishment. Why is there goals over there as well? So they got two ovals. Yeah, they got one oval the size of Marvel, one oval the size of the G. Well, the it's front, weird you compare this to Arden Street. <laughs> <laughs> like, Arden Street was not, this, not bad, don't get me wrong, but like, just that you can't even, like, what is this? This looks do, do they have open trainings? Like, can their fans go to their trainings ever? Why can't you just walk in and have a kick? <laughs> the barbed wire has stopped us from getting in. We just want to get in and touch that logo. I think we failed because we can't touch the logo. Ah, that counts. We yeah, can. that counts. counts. Going to every footy club driving challenge. We're going to every footy club driving challenge. Stop for a bit of Mackie D's. It took 25 minutes to go from Footscray to Essendon, and then we couldn't get into Essendon. So we're now driving to Geelong. We're about three quarters of the way to GMHBA. We're on the home stretch. Here we are, the Cattery. I've experienced many uh, disappointing memories here, but it's the last leg. We have gone to every AFL club in Victoria. There's a logo. There. Seven hours in the car, Cookson. This is what dreams are made of. Oh, so. bruh. <laughs> Oh, Woo. do something to do something, baby. No seven. Oh, that cut looks a bit deformed. The Bulldogs and the Saints didn't have anything like this. We came, we yeah. saw, we conquered, we started in Torquay, went to Hawthorne, went all the way around the city, and now we are back finishing at GMHBA Stadium. Oh, I'm actually knackered. Yeah, I'm knackered. I cannot wait to go home and watch Making Their Mark on Amazon. Anyway, guys, I appreciate everyone who watched the video. I appreciate all the support, and we'll see you all very, very soon. Cheers.